So I'm here right off the road and it's just amazing. But there is a sawtooth mushroom and or a railroad wrecker. They, uh, this mushroom has the ability to eat through railroad ties. And let's see if I can pull it back. And if we look in there, there's some ants. They're probably pulling out the bugs that are in there. But if you look really close, you can see why it's called sawtooth. You can see all those gill edges look like teeth, like a, like a saw. Pretty cool. I don't think it's, I think it's probably buggy. Actually, it's clean. I'm going to take it. It's dried out, but I'm, I'm going to take it. This is also considered medicine by a lot of people. So, so here's another sawtooth right here, growing out of this stump. And you can see this one's kind of dried out too. Pull it. This is a little bit better of a specimen, though. I'm definitely going to take it. But you can see once again. See all the edges on the end of the gills kind of look like teeth. Here's some real beauties. Look at that. These are really nice. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Cool. So a nice little haul here. So put them in the bag. Got this great little duffel bag. Works great for these guys. Alright, there we go. Beautiful. So we have the sawtooth here with garlic and ichnish. And love. And love. Lots of love. Gotta have the love. Indian celery, olive oil, butter. Beautiful. Bon appetito. Of course. We're here live, camping in the middle of nowhere in Where Frenchman's, <laughs> Frenchman's drainage. I'm We're doing morel. And what do we got here, chef? Billy Bob special. Billy Bob special. Morels. Morels, radish, radish, garlic, shallot. Snap peas. With abalone. We got some sawtooth mushrooms and some salmon. Mm -hmm. Wow. And, and some avocados over there. And some, yes. salsa. and some salsa. Get her done. Get yeah. it in, you not on you.